What is going on guys today? Blazing Tech here as usual. I've got a brand new Apple product that I picked up today. I wasn't too happy about picking it up but um, yeah well I'm gonna go ahead and unbox it for you guys and kind of tell you how I got rope-a-doped into buying this thing or rather maybe Apple got rope-a-doped by me so let's just talk about it. I haven't bought an Apple product in a long time so it looks like they abandoned that nice plastic those nice plastic bags and they had these straps now it's just a paper bag um, not very green but knowing Apple it's probably recycled oh look 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 let's see what it says what does it say a circular knit handle made entirely from paper Bag made from 80% post-consumer content, 100% recyclable and reusable. Okay, cool. I'll just keep this in my car and use it for groceries and whatnot. Pretty cool. But what I've got in the bag is the new, I guess you could call it new, iPhone SE? I don't know. What, what, what do you guys want to call this thing? New, old, teaching old dogs new tricks. Um... I don't know. Interesting. Interesting. Um, yeah, they wanted to open it for me and everything, but got my SIM card right here. I actually, where is it? Okay, there it is. I traded in, there it is. I traded in my iPhone 6 for this guy, so we'll see. We'll see what goes on. So let's just go ahead and unbox this. Here we go, you see this kind of sea anemone type deal on the front here. iPhone SE on the side. I'm not going to show you the back because that's my personal information to my phone right here. Apple logo, iPhone SE. Very nice. Very typical Apple fashion plain box. So let's just go ahead and unbox it. So I went in originally with the intention of having them warranty my iPhone 6 because even though it was two years out of warranty, I saw a, a dark circle when I would take pictures and I'd say it might have been the size of a penny. So maybe like this big, or no, 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 smaller, like that big, you'd see a little black type shadow deal. And I did, I really, I hated it actually. So I took it in and I told them, yeah, I'd like, I'd like a refurb because I know that they've just got refurb sitting back there with no intention of buying a new phone. And they were telling me, yeah, yeah, we'll take care of you and everything. Uh, I got the unboxing knife. Cut this slowly. Oh, yeah. It's always nice to unbox an Apple product. Pleasant. But, um, yeah, they were telling me, oh, it's going to cost you 59 or 159 to replace the camera if you wanted to do that since it is out of the one-year warranty. I said, no way in hell am I going to do that. So I asked them how much they'd give me for that phone. And they told me iPhone 6, 16 gig AT&T, perfect condition. Other than that problem, they gave me 250 for it. And I used that as a down payment and I just picked this up. So the plastic shrink off. Let's move the camera so you can see. Here we go. Another iPhone, guys. This might be my last one, but you don't have to tell Apple that, or you can tell them. <laughs> so here we go, SE, small edition, same edition, and it just it just fits really well in my hand, particularly. So I can go one, two, three, four. I think I think I'll end up being really happy with this. It'll be nice and clean. I did get 64 gigs, so four times the storage of my iPhone 6, so that should be good. I actually haven't had a black iPhone since my iPhone 3G. And yeah, space gray, it looks really clean, I like it. Let's just power it on. And yeah, that was just a really quick unboxing, guys. Um, kind of just um, a quick little video, you know, just to show you that I picked up one. I will do one on the um, 
the switch between the 4.7 inch to the 4 inch, the mighty 4 inch iPhone SE from an iPhone 6 to tell you kind of how I dealt with it in everyday life and that yeah that should be a pretty cool video this is actually unlocked but you guys know how all this is the box and everything I'm gonna go ahead and set it up and we'll, we'll end this video right here you know how these this box is yep ear pods wall plug lightning nothing special then you probably have stickers and manuals in here but yeah thanks for watching guys I do have that vlog if you haven't seen it. Um, it's on my channel. It's really cool. I took a nice road trip with my grandpa and my cousin to Crater Lake. And yeah, it was just a really pleasant <laughs> pleasant trip. Nice scenery. Um, a little bit of patience on my end. You should definitely watch the vlog. I'm working on a part two of that vlog. Basically the second half of the trip. Right before I left, I got a bunch of goodies. So... Here, I'll just show you what I'm going to do a review on soon. So, for starters, I've got the lens that I'm using right now. Super sharp Sigma 30mm f2.8 for Sony E-mount. Very cool. I picked up a vlogging tripod. I've got the Joby now. I think it's the Joby GoPod or something. Something really light for mirrorless. And it's kind of kind of small, but it's it works for my A6000. Um, I did get a mic system for my Sony a6000, but I did get this clip mic too, which I really like using. I need to do a review on that. The ECM CS3, very nice microphone. And I also picked up some batteries for my a6000, and I should be doing a review on all these products eventually. School starts up in about three weeks, so I kind of want to do a couple more videos right before it starts up. I'm going to be a senior in high school now, and the responsibilities are getting bigger and bigger, so it should be fun. But anyway, yeah, just a quick unboxing of the iPhone SE. It actually feels really good. I'm pretty excited about it. Thanks for watching, guys. Stay tuned for more content on the channel, and definitely check out all my other content. Thanks for watching, guys. Blazing Tech, we'll catch you on the next one.